We're still pretty busy, but in a more, uh, domestic sense. I guess no one needs a hero right now. Oh. Oh. Possession is an illusion. Do not all things belong to the cosmos? This vessel suffers from wounded chai. Only the power of the crystals can hope to heal it. Uh, uh, you are getting very sleepy. Megacorp intends to market a killer that is simply unconscionable. Is everyone ready for tonight's Mega Battle? Introducing, from nowhere in particular, this guy! You're getting sleepy! Very sleepy! Ah! A customer! You, sir, look like someone who could use a hypnomatic! Welcome, welcome! Uh, if everyone could take their seats, we can proceed with today's demonstration. Gentlemen, you have my most profound gratitude. Imbecilic to the very last. All I need now is a new galaxy with a new fan base so I can rescue them from a new disaster! <laughs> <laughs> Here at the Megacorp testing facility, we make sure the products you buy are safe for you and your family. These are just a few of the products we've rejected to help keep you safe. The Tiny Tot Slingshot, the Nuclear Mousetrap, Self-Wedgifying Underwear, and the Lawn Ninjas. So the next time your toaster doesn't explode in your face, say a little thank you to the Megacorp testing facility. All of the protopets in the galaxy come from right here, in our factory. Your little friend is lovingly extracted from the original protopet. Hello, you lucky devil has just sent you a galactic greeting. You the lost Megacorp! Take your imperialistic eco-fascism to another dimension! Say goodbye to your Frankenfest! It works! My invention works! It's called the Therminator. It fires charged thermal pellets that can thaw an ice block or freeze a body of water! Gadgetron will pay me millions! Dr. James T. Fullbladder reporting on Megacorp experiment number 13. This update is strictly classified. If you are watching this, you're fired. I swear that crazy old man is not the same person I used to work for. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You used to work for Megacorp? Yes! In the genetics division. On the protopet? On fixing the protopet's flaws! And I was this close to succeeding when Fizzwidget suddenly pushed up their release date. <sighs> Thank you for choosing Megacorp, where our customers come first. This is Darla Gratch, reporting live from Algon City, where Protopet Mania is in full swing. For those who've spent the past week in hypersleep, the Protopet is Megacorp's wildly popular bioengineered pet. Adorable, non-allergenic, and housebroken, fans of the creature have dubbed it the perfect companion. Between the protopet's surprisingly low price tag and its lightning-fast breeding cycle, there may soon be more than enough protopets for everyone. Darla Gratch, Channel 64 News. Welcome back to Behind the Hero. Tonight's heroes are the duo who recently restored peace and order to our galaxy, Ratchet and Clank. So, gentlemen, tell us about your latest incredible adventures. Well, you got the helmet, you're ready. Easy peasy. The prize this time is some kind of special boots. I could use those myself. They go real nice with my leather chaps. Even with the abject savagery of one's own kith and kin, is quite more than one can bear sometimes. No! The torment I was all... 
Why is Billy sad? Is he cold? Hungry? Or maybe just lonely? Introducing the Megacore Protopet. Your child will shriek with joy when he meets our adorable friend. Wanna play ball? So does the Protopet. Need a partner for tag? Go find the Protopet. Up for some cops and robbers? So is you know who. Just ask Billy. What is your problem? I'm trying to make a living here, and you two losers keep lousing it up! Ratchet and Clank, isn't it? Yeah. Look, if you two don't hightail it back to your own galaxy, I'm gonna blast you into so many pieces you'll need a... Um, uh, well, there's gonna be a lot of them. I can tell you that. Before I became a desert rider, I didn't fit in anywhere. I had low self-esteem, bad breath, and a thing for ladies' undergarments. <laughs> but these guys understand me. They really do. The man. The myth. The legend. The loser. Captain Quark, once the idol of everyone in the galaxy, has finally hit rock bottom. For the fifth time, I have a collect call to thugs for less from a Mr. You Are Gonna Die. Will you accept the charges? Defeating enemies gives you experience. Experience is used to increase your max health and upgrade your weapons. Take it easy, Chief. I ain't looking for no trouble. Just an honest man looking to make an honest buck. Oh no! No, 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 take it away! No! Help! Police! Some dead burned fool flushed this perfectly good quark action figure. Yeah, it's a little ripe, but look at that craftsmanship! Subject 23A, please report immediately for crotchetizer testing. Nobody, I mean nobody, gets by the mathematician. That moon's where we divide losers from winners before adding them to the Megacorp games. There's a challenger up there ready to reduce you to nothing. The wind in your hair, the sun on your skin, the bugs in your teeth. We are the Desert Riders. So if you've got what it takes, use this temporary membership to enter the most grueling hoverbike race in the galaxy. Win it and become one of us. Desert Riders, the number one leisure choice of Thugs for Less. Psst, got a ship that needs, uh, improvements? Worried about getting caught? At Slim Cognitos, your secret is safe with us. Whether it's weapons, shielding, or a new hyperspace module, we'll hook you up quickly, cheaply, and most important, quietly. Mommy, where do protopets come from? Why, they come from Megacorp, dear. <laughs> Excuse me. I think I just blew another vacuum tube. My word! You young people are so fresh these days! Oh, don't feel bad. I guess I'm just old-fashioned about that sort of thing. Did you know that I've been with Gadgetron since the beginning?